One day there was something that I needed to know. I don't know why I'd never asked her before, but I hadn't. Mom was in her room under the covers when I found her to ask her. She would not open her eyes when I called her. Mom! And so I went to the foot of the, her bed, crawled up under because that is what I wanted to ask about anyway. It was hot and dark under the covers. It smelled like dirty clothes. I can see in the dark. I could see Mom's night clothes, which were torn and bunched around her legs. I crawled up to where her legs joined together or split apart, whatever, and I screamed. What are you? And she screamed back at me louder than anything I had ever heard. What on earth are you wondering? Is this what makes us girls? I asked, and I started to cry. I told her that I didn't understand what I was or why I was made the way that I was or what all of the knobs and outcroppings of snots and waxes that are a part of me, what any of them are for. She breathed fire on me and reached out to me with tentacles and claws and pulled me into her so that I could not breathe air anymore. She screamed even louder now. This is what you are for. We have many mouths and many voices, and ours is to scream and to suffocate and death to all boys. She erupted from her holes, and she had so many of them, and everything that had been inside was coming out, and everything was outside melted into the bed sheets and covers. My legs and arms turned hard like wood and would not move for many years. But then you came and found me and cut my limbs from where they were stuck. Mom was wrong to wish death to boys. <laughs>